time for Eye on Business with the Greater Memphis Chamber's President, Phil Trenary. On March 16th, we present our Supplier Diversity Collaboration to the Edge Board. Today, our Chairman of the Board, Carolyn Hardy, is here to talk about her passion for this initiative and the required buy-in from the business community. Carolyn, maybe you can give us a, a little background on this. Many have seen the numbers. Minority and women-owned business receive less than 1% of all business receipts. The African-American unemployment rate is 14%, while our overall is only 6%. When I decided to take the role of chairman, you knew this issue was important to me. The chairman's vision is to create economic growth for all, and the chairman's 2016 goals prove that you really mean for all. The collaboration on this initiative is unparalleled, and it's going to take all of us working together to make a real impact. Carolyn, why is private sector participation so important in achieving our goals? We can't make the kind of change that's needed to put people to work and grow receipts for MBWEs without the private sector. Government spending is just not enough to move the needle. But an easier, more accessible strategy will allow companies to keep up and comprehensively change the way business is done in Memphis. Tell us about the role the Chairman's Circle plays in this strategy. Right now, Chairman Circle companies are participating in an audit to determine how many have supplier diversity policies in place. They will either be asked to contribute to public reporting on diversity spending or receive assistance in forming a supplier diversity policy. Chairman Circle members have also agreed to be part of our mentor protege program with MBWE companies, which we'll share more about later. Thank you, Carolyn. Join us next time to hear more about the supplier diversity collaboration. I'm Phil Trenary. See you next week. This has been Eye on Business with the Greater Memphis Chamber's President, Phil Trenary.